Okay, uh, this guy, no problems about absolutely everything, the problems I'm going to suffer from. So what I want to do is, I want to video record this stuff. Because it was anywhere from saving how to save the video that he's got posted below. Uh, and then all the way even to the sauna issue for which he insisted me. Uh, it's going to eventually uh, save me a life because I will suffer from Candida and it's also the project he did for me and you see everywhere you see what you see you see fixed fixed he he is uh, he knows the answer to absolutely everything he insisted me also that here just like a Scotty Kilmer the guy the repairman the mechanic uh, told me uh, about the engine, what they're gonna do to me, la 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 la. Uh, that I have to watch his program, there is a solution posted for my problem, for my car problem, so that I can repair my... He too had a solution here posted somewhere for the laptop I told you about, they're gonna break one down to me. This is a little Scotty Kilmer in the world of computers, this guy, this dude. This guy was involved in this case now since I don't know when, man. 2000 or something like this, I don't know. He was a kid when he got involved in this stuff uh, and then worked his way through life literally using this case. Eventually moved down to Florida. So that I should also look for one of the videos here is what he whispered me, which is going to be a problem a solution to my future laptop problem. Oh, this is guy, all right, from the U.S. And he also had this guy here involved. This guy, this young kid. He had this one here, too. I just want to see... Um... Does this story sound familiar? There's this photographer. He's working on client photos. As he goes to grab a new batch of photos to work on, there's an odd feeling something is off. Then the panic starts. While searching through the computer, he looks everywhere. Okay, so what? It doesn't matter. So what I want to do is what I need to do is I need to I need to video record this stuff here. This guy um this kid, let me see this. You're scrolling through your phone and you realize something issues without any data loss. Use this by matching your problem under one of these four issues, iTunes, iOS, screen, or device issues. Press and I only have a couple of dollars. Okay, that's probably maybe even the main video from him. Uh, I'm gonna look into this stuff. Hello everybody, my name is Aaron, and today we're gonna look at the sure, seven digit sure. Instagram smurl. This is counting the followers for yeah. my wife, Pinksy Minxy, on Instagram. If you are interested in getting one... Yeah. Um... Hello everybody, my name is Aaron, and today we're gonna look at the... Sure. This is directly the guy who was involved in this very video. This is the guy who claimed me. Uh, I'm only going to be able to come to the certain point, uh, to the certain location with my video. And I will only be able to retrieve like 51% of the video. Then he was driving me crazy on that MK Ultra by claiming me it's going to be 51. Then he increased arguing with a psychiatrist, Peter Kopsch, with whom he worked, right? with whom he worked and they were trying to drive me insane uh, if asking him in front of me if he will allow so that I can retrieve 52% but initially making point 
out of that first 1%, 1% over 50%, by insisted me, insisted me if you could retrieve only a few seconds more than 50%, due to free video software that's offered online and offers you to retrieve 50% uh, of the video for free. You could prove your case is what he came up with, right? He instructed further, just like he did in his video. Look, I'm not even sure if this is the guy who did this video because it was so many people, computer people involved in this shit. Uh, but on general, he brainwashed me that joining two broken videos into one will eventually result in ability of using a free software which complementary gives one 50% uh, of the video. It retrieves you 50% it repairs you 50% of the video. So if you join two broken, so if you join broken video into two and you repair half of it of that two, you get entire video repaired for free because it's 50%. It's complimentary. So that's the guy that was like initial guy who claimed that he's gonna fuck me that he, but he is gonna fuck me no matter what that he's gonna be the one that he's gonna be the one no matter what but it was a better cop before he start to even using one that would go over all this issues computer pro problems the Peter cop is a psychiatrist involved in this case with all these problems with him uh, and with his son and with other people and have first seen what kind of issues I would face due to hacking, due to problem uh, that would be caused to me. And then he made entire life paranoia to me, all kinds of stuff he insisted on me, to me so that I would go and discredit myself. The same shit like with the tunnel under the house and uh, all kinds of theories like this about the the soap bars that mother is going to buy and those are going to kill me and all kinds of shit like this. So this is the guy. This is a little Scotty Kilmer. Uh, he had his eye on my laptops and claimed me for the other laptop I have. Uh, the one that you have heard me even blowing here with my mouth uh, inside of one so I could process the video. Uh, this was the one who had I specialized uh, into that laptop knowing of course also for this laptop that uh, I'm not going to be able to process videos longer than one hour on this laptop because this laptop ladies and gentlemen this is well this is this is a scam um, I don't blame the owner uh, for the scam because owner always was on my side this guy always was on my side but here you can see everything you can see right you can see that it says right here it's it's got 8 gigabyte RAM installed and this and that you can see that kind of stuff Windows 7 Ultimate is a Windows 32 bit so that you can have more problems but indeed this is capable for me of using also Windows uh, what is it 64 yeah 64 but it's 32 so they brainwashed and how you're gonna have a problem I don't know what that's why we're gonna do it so you're gonna have a problem la 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 yeah. uh, and it says here two core four logical processors um, two core four logical processors
I was pretty damn sure I got uh, that this is a four core uh, a laptop look the laptop is good I'm super grateful this laptop was worth much more money and everything and it can be upgraded and everything but they did play me down big time they did pull me for the nose the owner of this laptop the one who sold me one that's the best guy in the world he couldn't do absolutely anything about it he was the one he told me actually even make sure that you install new version of windows because they gonna do something to you he was he kept warning me about this stuff under mk ultra uh and uh well i did not have a key and with due to so many problems that i have i was afraid i'm gonna lose the key license and not be able to register windows and it's gonna be more problems the thing about it is that videos of mine continue and files continue to find their way into the trash bin it's all kinds of stuff that happened on this laptop not because this would be something new because I would use, as I was told, the case is going to be if you're going to download um, the repair software for uh, for this uh, video, and then uh, you're going to go to the shady sites, which they left on the internet, also packed them with uh, Trojans and so on. And they presented me those websites uh, during MKUltra. Well, there's this Czech website that I came across and so on all the people God knows maybe hundred maybe more software related people involved in this case not only people in the US but also people from India IT uh, and so on from all over the world British and so on oh, what is this here let me see this stuff here through this guy eventually when it comes to video repair I have even found the account that was created literally by the Russian guy. His name is Vladimir, just like a Vladimir Putin. And don't think that the guy is not friend of Vladimir Putin because this guy eventually even created this account for Vladimir Putin. This was one of the guys that would interact with the people inside of this house and would also come across people like Vladimir Putin and American officials. These are people that frequently used silicon masks to enter the country through the airports, all the way inside of the house to pose with me on numerous locations globally by having a silicon mask over my face literally by having silicon mask over my face I will never forget incident with a police director now Yanis Ogulin ever will I forget the incident at Tershkagora when he was the one dragging me from house to house and it was this house that people said they don't, they don't believe that that I am the one with him. And what he did was he pulled the mask, a silicon mask he had over my face. He pulled one off my face. And I heard people saying, oh, yeah, it's you. Oh, really, it's you. It really is you. And it was like this more than one occasion using a silicon masks to go to the airports enter the country enter this house enter this room have me next to them literally all over the internet you can or maybe you can't i don't know because they find you a mask they blend you inside that you can be seen and the best part about it is they label you as a paranoid schizophrenic and then go and argue with a profession with the psychiatry itself even that psychiatry in this case completely violated every rule in respect to the rules of the psychiatry 
So there you go. Let me demonstrate to you this Vladimir. This Vladimir is a friend of Putin. And what he did was so he would not be suspicious from Putin, but so that you could say, well, yes, it belongs to Putin. If I would be very nice to Putin, then Putin would say, yeah, it really is my account. You know, this is the guy that I think lives inside of the residential building where he took me. Moscow, I think. And this is his channel. This guy opposed to Putin loved very much to Caucasus. Caucasus. That's why I know that the guy who opened this channel was not Putin. But it's the channel that is shared or can be shared with Vladimir Putin if necessary. Always was on my side, always will help you, always will help you, aha, uh -huh. always will, aha, uh -huh. and then, it was five years ago, it says here, what exactly that means, 2017, Aaron is the name of this guy, told me, I don't think I'm going to be able to help you anymore, because he posted the comment, he posted the comment. And I here refer to this here. Okay. So, you know what? You know who the Scotty Kilmer is? This is the guy here. I have identified already his neighborhood. I can tell about everything. Scotchka. Scotchy Kilmer. Scotchy Kilmer is a mechanic. The one who's going to help you and save you. The one that you guys love to go see. A good mechanic. Not a bad one. The good one. The one who has a lot of... Rev up your engine! Run your engine, yeah. Ah, MG ah, and all the... He figured out that this kind of car that I purchased, that I will purchase, that I just... It would be best for me to have one broken because it's not a safe car you see and then he went on to rationalize that he's a good mechanic anyways because next to the videos that he will post for me that he already did post for me and it will answer with solution to what they're gonna do to you he had a good piece so he had a great piece of advice for me to go and buy myself i don't know a truck ford 150 or something like this it was a new one. You're going to make a new one and that's the kind of car you should be driving. There is a video I'm going to post also about my glasses. About my glasses. My dearest glass. If you remember in Poland, I worked, I commuted and worked with the glasses that were 50%. You couldn't see through them. You couldn't see through those glasses. And yet I had to do somewhat quite precision, precision involved work with it. It's like this with the glasses. After going to optic, uh, to physician, to examine my eyes, he had written a dip tree for me which an individual who processed the request, therefore oculist, uh, I don't even know how to say that in English, the one that uh, plays with a frame that, that inserts inside glass in your frame, violated and have inserted uh, his own dioptry. Uh, that, that means... Uh, on a short distance because this is this are glasses used for the short and for the long distance that's what he did that was number one thing and that's what I was told also in Poland you sir this does not even when they compare this 
stuff. They, they told me, this is not even your vision. I don't know how they have prescribed this vision uh, for nearsighted. Uh, dietary, they told me, it's not even your dietary. Anyways, I somehow managed to collect the money and bought myself new glasses from China, and they were really great. But they hijacked me from the hostel in Lourdes City, and before that they hijacked me from the hostel at Zgierz. And I disappeared, and I appeared here, and they already told me in Lodge Hostel, the second time they told me, well, that's when I already had these glasses, I bought brand new glasses. They told me, with brand new glasses, how this, uh, I don't know how you say this, seats, whatever you want to say this, the seats here, this uh, soft, soft uh, cushions, whatever you want to call this for the, you know, for the glasses to sit in your nose are going to break apart. They will break apart. They will be, uh, they will break apart. And I was like, how the F are they going to break apart? Uh, it's impossible. These are new glasses under MK Ultra. You know, they're going to break apart. They, they, we're going to put inside. Make sure, make sure that you clean inside good when you place another, uh, uh, when you make replacement and you come back home to Slovenia. And yeah, sure enough that they break me glasses, second pair of glasses again. Uh, and uh, basically it was my fault because I wouldn't go and replace those immediately. They told me the site is going to deteriorate itself. It reminded me here administration of the city uh, that... If I'm not going to get a second glasses, uh, what's going to happen is if I'm going to place these glasses, then I'm going to lose uh, the right to have a driver's license for 10 years or something like this, extended and so on. Then you have to go and repeat every three years and stuff like this they do. Um, my mother would leave me a paper on a table with the glasses to remind me. How I have to go buy myself a glasses uh, but so I rejected my mother's food in the face of psychiatrist in 2012 uh, because I didn't want to eat her food her stuff I wanted my job I wanted my stuff uh, but there is no job there is nothing and for saying that you don't want to eat mother's food you're mentally ill and so we go again with forced joblessness with broken glasses go to your mommy so the mommy can buy you glasses after you already bought brand new glasses and if you don't fix at least this thing here uh, we're gonna break your car that was also on a table it was okay all, all kinds of shit why they're gonna break me car if you don't fix one by then, and this and that, and da 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 da. You know how insultive, how difficult this stuff is? You know what is it to do the stuff like this to a person, to rate one as a paranoid schizophrenic and break one absolutely everything, and bully one like this, breaking him one, having mayor of the city involved, director of the police, psychiatrists involved in this stuff? That's not good, that's a violence. That's a violence. But these are the people that supposedly stand behind values, society values, which in which they would play prevention of the violence. So these are the people that supported violence, that incited in the violence, that bullied, that tortured, engaged in a physical torture. How can that be some kind of... Uh, what, what is this shit all about then in that case? You got to ask yourself. And the solution is that breaking the stuff, causing a problem to an individual, gives them the right to offer solutions, which, however, fit their needs. And so this is what this case is all about. Repairing the car, buying yourself new glasses, uh, repairing the computer, everything, uh, none of which would have been possible without these people.
because they're the people that break things in the first place. Today is April the 6th, 2022. I don't know what to tell you. Thanks for watching this video. This is the video that was related. If you catch this one, uh, and it's more than worth to see one, my proving de facto case about my video files my video files you understand my video files being hacked muted mutilated actually during video recording procedure itself and as i'm going to continue tomorrow in respect to this case i'm going to also prove you that it's more than this actually you know what i can prove you right here right now i don't see why tomorrow it's very easy for me to prove you this stuff right now this what you're about to see right now is the same video i have video recorded however i video recorded one one week ago For that matter, uh, I hope that's not going to be the case, but that precisely is the case. I do have to go to the hard drive and take you quickly through that one so that you can see because uh, the video was unplayable, but still I need one for the proof. This will go to the police department. This will be used uh, for the people that do play with video analysis stuff like this so the police will be able to go and analyze damage done to these videos how it was all done so that it can be officially used as a proof but video i'm talking about it's here this is the one I have recorded just yesterday and was destroyed during the video recording itself. And uh, uh, this is actually very difficult to, uh, very easy for me to even uh, see because it's not playable. So what I am going to do is you know, I am just going to do it like this. And we're going to go date like this. So that I wouldn't waste my time. We're just going to do this. And I bet. I'll pull that video fast. Out. Real fast. Find him a way back. So just so that I can demonstrate you what exactly that looks like. I know that I did throw some of these videos in a trash bin today. And uh, I do want to make sure that Mayor of Nova Master City, this is the file. And you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to restore one. Converter Factory uh, Output Video. Yeah, and it was 1.6 gigabyte, totally, totally unplayable. I tell you what, let's let's restore that stuff back. 
I'm going to keep all these videos. Now I gotta see to make sure that I have not even deleted one. Look, it doesn't matter. That's that's it for me for this video. That's all I want to say for this video. This video will be included inside April 6, 2022. The video from yesterday was completely unplayable. You could not play one. It was the video like mutated, mutilated in the same way like this one. However, once I connected uh, the internet to the laptop it became unplayable you could not even play one anymore that's all there was you could not upload one i couldn't upload one i couldn't play one it, it became totally unplayable and i am so sick and tired of this folks that you have no idea how sick i am of this stuff Let's go. I'm already for the day here inside. Just because I, I actually this already and did that. video it recorded work. this stuff. One, this is already stated. video recorded. You were able to see this. We're stuff. gonna go over now. Uh, it's I'm already gonna demonstrate online. here. I have how many it's videos I followed through. Failed to connect to Windows Would service. Help since it rescue become this unplayable. file. That's all. Or there is. for a matter of fact, I don't have a crap in time for this stuff anymore. That's all there is for this video. I'm gonna find that one, and that's all there is. Thanks for watching this video. Till next time.